Merry Christmas, my people. How na be? What's in the happen? What's in the sub? Welcome back to our channel. Here we have Tunde Ednot, and this time is about Cameo Loan Law. You're talking about Tunde Ednot. Guys, first I want to say there's a lot of um, fake account out there claiming to be Tunde Ednot. Just type Tunde Ednot on Instagram. Oh my God, you will see a million Tunde Ednot immediately. It's like everyone is waiting for Tunde Ednot to fall or to fail. <laughs> And some of these people might be his fans. Like, I absolutely have no idea. But they are impersonators. That's what I call them. Um, Kemi Loon lawyer, by the way, said he doesn't, that Tunde Ednot doesn't respect copyright. Now, after the news about Tunde Ednot's account being removed on social media, or on Instagram, rather, now there have been people, you know, talking about Tunde Ednot, like, oh, this and that, like, different names. They'll be calling him different names. Then. And the most recent one is Kemi Alone Lawyer saying that this guy doesn't respect copyright. This is the most um, comment that I've seen, that this guy stole their content, especially um, bloggers saying, this guy, you know, um, will steal our content without giving credit. And if you ask him or you reach out to him, he's going to abuse your mother. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, apart from that, he, um, she said that Tunde had not blocked her. And if at all, you know, Instagram is going to give back to the Ednot, this account is going to be in the next 18 months. Like, it's going to be very difficult for Tunde Ednot to get it. Um, let me quickly read what she said. Tunde Ednot blocked me 2018 on Instagram when I told him to remove my popular videos in 2018. He altered my captions. Um, nothing hurt a journalist more than when someone alters your work. He refused. I reported him to Instagram, who um, ultimately removed them. Tunde posted a lot of copyright things without credit. You only need three warnings and Instagram blocks your page for good. If they return it, it could be 18 months. Please respect copyright. Well, guys, let me know what you think about that in the comment section below. Moving on to the next one. Now, this one shocked me, seriously. It shocked you. It shocked me, actually. Nigeria ranks third highest top users on gay dating app so where are these guys if we rank third like where are these guys located because everyone is like it's like there's few gays in nigeria because nobody really come out <laughs> understand i don't yeah, understand what's going on you know the federal government against it and all that but people like bobiski are confidently own up to it but whiskey is tr transgender yeah is transgender but yeah they're still in the same community sometimes you know we just need to be true to ourselves there's a lot of gays in nigeria let me just let me just let you guys know um here the report says nigeria has as a match one of the highest users on popular gay dating platform the world's largest um, social networking app for gay bi trans and queer people well that is it now speaking about gays and transgenders here we have bobriski bobriski is um you know took us through the struggles as a man right and he said that even with everything he has his education and all that it was very difficult for him to make it in nigeria the money let's us let us read this this message is for you all to read before you judge me i was formerly a man for almost in five years nothing to show for it i kept struggling even with my certificate as a graduate of accounting in the university of lagos nothing to still show for it i saw how all my female friends were cashing out back then now i just think that this guy just wanted attention you know with all this because According to what I know about those people, they said they never chose to become it is not because of anything, it's because of it's who they are. So if people like Bobwiski, um I know I said they own up to it, but if people like Bobwiski coming out of the closet that they're trans and uh, blah blah blah, why are you saying it's because of money? So that is really not you. So is Bobwiski just doing this for business? I have no idea. Let me continue. I saw how my female friends were cashing out back then. I went home and think about my life. If I joined robbery, they, um, they would end up killing me. Um, secondly, I don't even have that heart. When I was growing up, I have a little bit of female features in me. So I decided to try what cross-dressing look like. On that one year of cross-dressing, I started making money. I was still surprised. So I gave my body more time. Rubbing expensive cream, smelling good and looking out for myself. Boom. More money keep coming. Same thing as um, 
this guy is James. They didn't caught me. That guy, James. Same thing as the guy. The guy said he's doing it just for money. That that is really not him. So <laughs> what's going on? Bobiski here, you know, Bobiski likes contradicting herself, by the way. Or himself. <laughs> um, he said here, if she didn't die during her sex change, trust me, I won't die. So what Bobiski is trying to say here is he is trying to go ahead to do the sex change in Colombia. Whatever it takes, whatever amount it takes, he is ready to pay to change, um, to finally change his sex organs, you like, to a female. Wow. <laughs> Guys, let me know what you think about that in the comment section below. Moving on to the next one. Here we have a lady who publicly said, look, my mother-in-law has to die before I marry anybody before i married the man of my dreams no matter what this man um the mom will have to die because i can't deal with the problems here she said before i get married to any guy the mother have to die because i don't have enough strength for mother-in-law's trouble <laughs> this kind of lady if mother-in-law never dies now she go kill him <laughs> if i love the guy so much i have to wait some of you if you're desperate that means you go kill him for the mother to die before we tie the knot. What about your own mother? I thought you have a brother, right? What if another lady is praying for your own mother to die? I don't know. What's wrong with people? Moving on to the next one. Here we have a lady in Cameroon who interrupts a wedding after discovering the man getting married is the father of her two children. This happened in Cameroon, guys. And then this lady stormed the church to stop it. Like, hold on. This man has two kids with me. And this wedding, are you kidding me? Guys, let's watch this. Madam. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on, speaking about marriage here, we're getting gradually into marriage, you know, little by little. Here we have Whiskey. That is, I know that's the last person you will ever think of, right? Well, Whiskey said, next year, I am getting married, whether you like it or not. Next year, I'm getting married. That is 2020. In 2019, that was when he posted this and somebody reminded him saying today is the last saturday of the year are you now lie through your head so they are telling whiskey that why do you lie you told us that next year 2020 you will marry and you know marry <laughs> my brother even 2020 no go marry himself because the trouble with 2020 he rich to, to postpone <laughs> moving on to the next one here we have omali omali said what the f man i've been falling in love anyhow these days what is going on and somebody said <laughs> Omali don't toast Thames for Uganda. That's why they fall in love anyhow. Maybe him and Thames, something they go on where they don't want to let us do. It kind of makes sense if you think about it. Maybe yeah, when they were going through all that, all those phases in their lives, you know, in, in Uganda, they, 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 they exchange informations. I have no idea. Uh, moving on to the next one. Here we have the motivational speaker. The king of all the girls, you know. In, uh, on Instagram, Etinosa. Etinosa, not only that she's pregnant, we only got the information or the video that she's pregnant uh, now, but guys, she has put to bed. She don't born before we even started to see the picture, before the information got online, but this is a lady who has, you know, publicly fought against, you know, different things that has to do with ladies, and it seemed like, ah, this one, are uh, the kind of um, lady to emulate, say, you understand, say, she they fight, she be feminist, she they do all these things. All of you that like follow photo, now be this who, at the end of the day, she don't get belly put to bed. Men are this, men are that. Men are, okay, when are, <laughs> <laughs> well, here we have someone who replied to Tinosa, that's Victoria Inyama, the actress. She said, so Madam Perfect has a baby. Congratulations. I am still alive and well to see this. So you have also joined our single moms group chat. You mock me with death 
but I won't do the same to you. But I dedicate that Cash Out Lincoln and Zlatan song to you. And by the way, the main person will get the song. Uh, you don't even put in name. <laughs> Hopefully, motherhood will bring some joy into your life so you know that life dishes different meals. Hopefully, you will stop projecting your despairs onto others. But uh, most importantly, fill your baby with love and wish others well. Stop wishing death to a person older than you. Pray to get to that beautiful old age. And have you guys noticed when people like this get pregnant or they put to bed, they change all of a sudden. People like both pink. You should go check out both, both, both pink first deleted all our videos. Then she now, you know, acts like a saint. <laughs> like somebody that well let me just stop there we have um rita dominic rita dominic shows off her man and this man is a daily times publisher his name is fidel isano ck she shared the photos recently on ig beautiful picture hmm <laughs> actress rita dominic actually you know calm down to choose this one i wish them well in their journey speaking about johnny here we have <laughs> will be franklin and 40 baby mama they travel to dubai to have fun remember this was the same baby mama that called will be frank will be franklin that be that this and that blah 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 bash will be franklin up and down and guess what she posted why do we are having fun i'm having the best vacation ever best vacation ever i hope you guys will not come on social media again and start saying rubbish 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 tomorrow we'll, you know hook up you understand another picking on the load again like that small small after fight <laughs> um speaking about picking here we have the fathers of all nations timaya flavor two face Libya. you know whiskey don't join them they video you know <laughs> by the way we, have, we just have two of them here flavor and timaya making fun of each other now you're not two days inside on top of the same table i did buy us and now with your baby pops me and you did the same thing. No. Why, why, yeah. <laughs> I don't want to. Boy, no, somebody don't No, don't understand this. Way. That one no be problem. They don't do it down already. Hmm. See this sarcastic man. Uh, yeah. Younger guy, fresh. Oh, Sixteen, yeah. seventeen. Let's <laughs> that make me fresh. Like. About marriage here, someone who is saying that any couple where they try to wed they must obtain clearance in lagos because of the covid 19 if you if your aim is to have 300 you know guests you must obtain clearance they must know look everywhere be sure see that place is safe before they allow you well let me know what you think about that in the comment section but the good news right here comedian mc lively gives his mom a brand new car amazing wow That time, um, Okutex <laughs> boutique. <laughs> I used to use your small money to buy clothes for us. We decided to use this uh, our own small money to buy small something for you, small present. Thank you very much, Father, for helping us. This is a good news. Considering he's an Instagram comedian and he started, you know, from nothing, you know, to something. That's great. Um, here we have Omale and the Hedis. Remember, Omale was nominated, you know, for the uh, Hedis um, Nest Rated. Uti, doing this um, interview with Hip TV, said he's rooting for Omale. I'm rooting for a lot of people, Omale. About the fact that some people have been comparing his looks to mine. They're like, oh my God, he could pass for your younger brother. So for me, I'm like, okay. And he has a fantastic voice. Um, I like uh, the, the mood of his music. I love his genre. Yeah, I'm ready for Omale. Who are you rooting for? The next rated. Um, I hope <laughs> uh, this this will actually work out for Omale though. In be getting arrested and trading on social media, you know, for a while, that will also help boost Omale's career. In fact, it's already boosted his career anyway. And guys, this is I don't know if I should say this is funny, but this man goes bald after purchasing a fake dye. Can you just just watch this video? What's wrong with this song? See, see, see. Oh, if, head, no. if you get money, I say, okay, come on. Come on, see. Just let me add a move as a server. We'll go fast. 
Now you won't be for Abina only. I don't know. Moving on to the next one. For those of you, you know, that know this lady, Auntie Ramota. I'm sure you quickly understand this video, right? This is Auntie Ramota going on a date on Christmas Day. That is amazing. Right? If you're on Instagram and you don't know Auntie Ramota, you need to check her out. Right? Let's watch this. So for now, yeah, now my baby come out to say to the Kulofa. To say hi to them now. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year in advance. <laughs> Here we have the ex Big Brother Nigeria housemate, Ifu and Nada, saying that a plumber stinks. In other words, my plumber is killing me. How do you tell someone they stink without hurting their feelings? Stink is already hurting people's feelings. <laughs> People, eh? <laughs> a certain plumber that comes to work in my apartment or building always smells each time he comes here. It's so bad that the smell overpowers my apartment and gives me um, a sharp headache. I always have to open my windows with an apron. Uh -uh, and I suck away the person carry people for it. I beg you. If you they lie, make you make you they reduce the lies much more. The man is way older than me, and I really don't know how best to tell him. Um, he smells without hurting his feelings, but it's killing me. Adam, calm down. Well, guys, let me know what you think about that in the comment section. Comment section below. Thank you so much for watching. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year in advance. Make sure I enjoy you. Make sure I know whether you get money or you don't get money. If you get peace, appreciate God. And if you get money, take care of jelly, 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 jelly. You know, stay away from drugs though, and take care of yourself as the most important thing. Guys, the question of the day: Which celebrity do you think relates most with fans? Leave your answers in the comment section below. Thank you once again. Till we see you next time. Peace.